Hi, this is Sharon at FitInFun.com and we're looking at my Lightroom 3. Um, I wanted to go over a few things that I do in here and as soon as I opened it up I found this and I'm working on my excuses for messiness and I thought this would give you a good summary. I don't know if you can read it or not but if you use Lightroom you know exactly what I'm talking about here. You can how you find stuff one of the many ways in this fab program I love is that you can right click down here it pops up to whatever you last had but then you can go to all photographs real quick or if you have a collection or the stuff you just brought in those three you know you, everybody who uses Lightroom is going to do this well it also has something down here favorite sources I don't do that but recent sources will tell you different things that you've searched for and tried to use um, and I'm trying to think of some examples offhand and I can't but I'll just show you the only two that are there since last time I cleared it and I, uh, with Lightroom I go through and clear out my history every like three weeks or so because I have o over 45,000 photos on here now and I just it slows down so that's one way a tip I learned to um, keep your Lightroom working faster and more efficiently was to go and clear your history every once in a while because maybe you searched for four star photos that related to birds which would be something I would have done in July maybe or June and I certainly have not searched for that again I don't need that in the memory right now for any reason so just clearing those kind of searches out of your recent sources is a, a good strategy and I've done that and it hasn't been, I haven't done it forever, I can't even think how long it's been right now because I've had all this stuff going on and I look at it and the only two things in here I've searched for are video files and collection without keywords everything else I've used what I had, I haven't searched so <clears throat> I haven't looked and let's go see how many without keywords I have right now oh goodness, a lot, I'm going to have to say for sure well, I think I should have just gone there, right? There we go, without keywords. Um, if you know what this thing is, let me know. Okay, without keywords, 4,068 photos. And I'm going to link to my post. It's at least a year old. I went through a procedure. I think at that time I only had 3,000 <laughs> without, and now I'm worse and I tried to improve and I do go through in keyword I definitely am much better than way back when but I have a high volume and I do other things so it's really bad so that kind of um, tells you about my messiness and then the next thing is all these video files I clicked on something else and put it in my history but I have a lot of video files right now I have 374 and I'm going to do a video after this and tell you what in the world is going on there. I hope you're fitting in fun with whatever it is you're doing.